Hello, everybody. My name is Mao. Welcome to my tea party. Uh, early October, I went back to China for my、uh, cousin's wedding. Uh, so today I'm going to show you、uh, what the、uh, wedding reception is like in China and what we eat at the wedding. I went to the wedding reception a bit earlier because I had duty on the day.、Uh, me and my other relatives stood behind this desk and collected the、uh, gift from the guests, and also asked them to write their name. On the notebook and return the lucky money to the guest. Nowadays, the wedding held in the city are quite a mix of the、um, Chinese and West feeling.、Um, the decoration of the reception, the white wedding dress, the tuxedo, the wedding cakes are quite a Western feeling. When the new couple、uh, toast. To the guests at each table, the bride will normally change to Chinese、uh, red wedding dress. I personally think nowadays the、um, most Chinese element of a wedding is the food. Here is the menu. It has both Chinese and English names on it.、Uh, in its English name is quite、um, plain. And it tells you、uh, what are the ingredients and、uh, how to cook it. But the Chinese names in brackets are the good wishes to the new couple. So each dish has lucky and meaningful name in Chinese. The first main dish is Hou Suckling Pig. Its Chinese name is Hong Yun Dan Tou, Lucky Strike. For Chinese food, it's important to maintain the wholeness for the dish, and so it is normal to see. Um, the whole pig with the head and tail, the whole chicken、uh, with the head and ass, and the whole fish、uh, served on a plate. We only eat the skin of the pig; it's crunchy. The second dish is baked Boston lobster with cheese in superior soup. Its Chinese name is Long Tong Hu Yue, Dragon's Rising and Tiger Sleeping, because the lobster in Chinese is called Dragon Prom. That is how its Chinese dish name is from. Cheese is not quite Chinese ingredient, but the presentation of the dish is quite Chinese. It keeps the head and tail. The third dish is fried beef and oyster mushroom with walnut. Its Chinese name is Zao Sun Gui Zi. May you soon have a baby. Why I have no idea how、um, why it's called this name. Anyway, next one. The next dish is a salty deep-fried minced shrimp and garlic pork rib. Its Chinese name is Jing San Tian Hua, icing on the cake. I have no idea where this name is from, but、um, the salty deep-fried minced shrimp is really good. And the next dish is soup. Its name is stew sea cucumber with masutake and dry scallop. Its Chinese name is Feng Tiao Yu Sun. The wind and rain come in that time. I think it's because this soup, so、um, that's why it has its name. The wind and the rain come in that time. And、um, Canton soup is quite famous, and we normally only drink the soup, but we do not eat the、uh, cucumber, sea cucumber, or the scallop in the soup because we believe the essence of all these ingredients. Is in the soup. The next dish is steamed alaboni with ginger juice. Its Chinese name is Store Our Gold Accumulate Jade. I guess it's a very expensive dish. The next dish is called deep fried sliced whelk with exo sauce.、Uh, it did not mention what ingredients. The um black um mua. Uh, hey, more.、Uh, can you see the、um, black things on the dish? That is more. It is a type of mushroom. The Chinese name of this dish is good match in marriage. I guess it's the、um, color of the、uh, dish. The black more and white whelk are a match in the dish.
The next dish is boiled chicken with scallion oil and soy sauce. Its Chinese name is Xuan Chue Bao Xi. Couple magpie festivity.、Uh, in China, magpie is the symbol of lucky. So here is not the real magpie, but magpie chicken above. So just people use the、uh, metaphor for the name. The next dish is steamed garuppa with light soy sauce.、Uh, its Chinese name is Yue Longmen, a fish leaping over the dragon gate. The name is from Chinese folklore. It means successful. As I mentioned before, in China, people like to keep the wholeness of the dish. So you can see we can still keep the head and tail, although the best part is in the middle. The next dish is soaked baby cabbage in superior soup. Its Chinese name is Kai Zhi Shang Ye. It normally refers to a tree has new branches and new leaves, and here it means a family settle down and have offspring. The next dish is fried rice with sea urchin. Its Chinese name is Wu Gu Feng Deng. A big harvest. Of all crops,、mm. I think it's because the、um, rice is the main crop in China, and pining are the rice on the plate is like the big harvest of all the、uh, grains or the crops. The next one is Chinese sweet dimsum. Its Chinese name is reunion, and tuan tuan yuan yuan. This、uh, Chinese dimsum is jian dui in Chinese. Uh, it's deep fried、um, glutinous rice ball with sesame seeds. Maybe I can try to make it one day. The next dish is sweet soup, and、uh, red bean with lotus seeds and lily root soup. Its Chinese name is Tian Tian Mi Mi, sweet as honey. This is a must-have dish in a wedding menu because lotus seeds in Chinese is lian zi. It means having a lot of baby. Lily root in Chinese is. Bai He, he symbols be together for a hundred years. So the whole dish means have a lot of baby and have a long lasting sweet marriage. The last one is seasonal fresh fruit combination. Thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed the show. If you like my video, please follow, comment, and subscribe me. See you next time.